You know that new movie, Sounds of Freedom? Well, this is Smells Like Freedom. We're making homemade diesel, boys. In good redneck fashion, I'm going to show you how to make it. So I'll take an empty 55-gallon drum. I'll put these little bricks on it, and I'll put the smaller barrel on top of that. I drilled a small little hole in the smaller barrel and lined it up with the bung of the 55-gallon drum. So we're taking the used motor oil, and we're pumping it into this top barrel here. It's being filtered through the bed sheet that's ratchet strapped to the barrel, and then it's falling down below as filtered, quote unquote, and then going down into the red barrel there. Since I started doing this about a year ago, I've drastically improved the flow here, so now I can filter a lot more quicker. Now comes the fun part of adding the gasoline. So in the summertime, I'll add five gallons of gasoline to 50 gallons of used motor oil. And this part sucks because, you know, these gas cans just take forever to uh, empty out. But we make it through. We get the gas in there. Last step here, I have a wooden dowel that I stick into the barrel. And then I start swinging it around, mix up all the gas and oil, like I'm churning butter back in the 1800s. And once that's all mixed up, I let it sit for about a week, and then I can pump it right into my truck and use it down the road. I definitely encourage questions. So if you have some questions, leave them down in the comments and I'll reply.